Hi, I'm Alan Cylinder. And I'm his daughter, Chelsea Cylinder. We're Cylinder Cylinder. And today we're here to talk about Barbie. This is a real candy-colored visual treat starring Margot Robbie and Ryan Gosling. Yes, and this is about Barbie and Ken, and they live in Barbie land, very separate from the real world. And in Barbie land, women rule everything. Women have way more power than men. It's very different than how things are in the real world, but Barbie gets mixed up with the real world and discovers what the real world really is like. Okay. And Margot Robbie plays Barbie, and she is the perfect Barbie. Really perfect. This is a lot of fun, and it's a pretty original movie. It gets a little preachy at times, which I didn't like, but for the most part, I really enjoyed it. And the main reason I enjoyed it is because of the spectacular performance of Margot Robbie. She is just so great, and she's great just about in everything, but this is really one of her high points, I thought. I also thought Ryan Gosling looked like he was having a lot of fun and is really enjoyable to watch as well. I loved this movie. This was fantastic. I have so many good things to say about this movie. First, I agree, Margot Robbie was amazing. I thought Ryan Gosling was amazing too. He was hilarious. He is the perfect Ken. I've been saying this since the first photos leaked of him on set. He just looks perfect. But this movie is really creative, really well thought out, and actually, I think it ran the risk of being really preachy, but it wasn't. I thought at times it was. No, but I mean, it was, but it really could have been cringy and sappy, and it was not. No, I thought not. it was handled no. very tactfully and made a good point and I liked the point that it made and I liked the way the point was executed. <laughs> the point is driven home a little too often, but... No, so the movie has a pretty star-studded cast in addition to those two and one of the co-stars is America Ferreira and she has this gigantic monologue at the end which talks about women's place in the real world society and that could have gone wrong and it didn't. I just thought it was really well written, well done. The movie's written by Greta Gerwig and Noah Baumbach and I thought the script was great. I loved the movie. The America Ferrera and her daughter characters are unfortunately tropes you'd see from a lesser movie. They're not used badly, but I wish they could have come up with a more original idea than how they bring them into the story. That said, it doesn't really kill the movie by any means, and most of the movie is very original and very good. And there are even some fun musical numbers. I think the film would have been better as a musical. It certainly lends itself to a musical. There's no question. Oh, it totally lends itself to a musical. It's really good. This is currently in theaters, and I would give this movie three and a half cylinders. I would give this movie four and a half cylinders. Whoa, Barbie. <laughs> this is Alan Cylinder. And Chelsea Cylinder. Saying, see you at the movies. Bye.